What's going on guys? So for this week, I worked a little bit more on the fish that are going to be in my game. Um, so I'm starting with three different type of fish for each type of water. And right now I'm working on the ocean. So some of the most common fish from the research that I've done um, are grouper, salmon, and sea bass. I'm sure there's a lot of others, but these are the ones I started with. And uh, I was actually able to recreate or actually use the model of the sea bass and kind of tweak it a bit, change the mesh around in order to make the other two meshes for the fish. So uh, that's what I did this week. I, I put them into the, uh, I used a texture and then I put them into Unity. And I just got to do a little bit of research on the sizes so I, so I can compare in meters how big each fish is. Uh, so that's what I did this week. And I'll be honest, I didn't work on it all that much because I am working on my other channel, which is uh, Indie Progress Plays. And it's been crazy for uh, the last, I went from like 200 subscribers to like 3,000 in the past month. So it took me like a year to get 200 subscribers and then like a month to get to 3,000 plus. So I'm not really putting in like the 40 hours a week that I normally do. Um, on my game and this is probably going to be temporary but just until uh, the hype dies down but uh, it has helped bring some people and if you guys have subscribed thank you from the other channel to this one because there are some uh, RNG type Diablo elements that are going to be in this game uh, but overall that's where I'm at for next week I'm going to be working on the armature for the fish probably and the animation of them swimming and then after I put them into the game with the AI script, I'll probably work more on the coral and things like that on the, the bottom of the ocean. And then we'll see where we go from there. But um, overall, pretty happy with the with the progress I've made on both channels. And uh, let me know if you have any questions or comments below. Um, Arthur, I know you mentioned to put uh, some sea monsters in the game. So that's actually a good idea um, where I can make it a little bit more difficult as the player explores deeper waters and uh, maybe change. So I'm going to do everything with like a level. So like an NPC level for every type of uh, fish and animal and human in the game. And the more challenging or higher level fish will be uh, further out. So you might be able to, well, you'll, you will be able to catch, you know, bigger fish, which will be a higher level as you go deeper into the ocean. Um, but I will probably make it so there's treasure or more valuable tre treasure deeper into the ocean and will likely be guarded by sharks or other type of sea monsters probably. So we'll see, but that was a great idea and uh, I look forward to the progress I'll make next week. So that's it. Thanks for watching.